morning. It is currently 9.12 on a Sunday. For my last video, I installed the TEs as you can see. So finally got them on. My TE 37 ICB specs with Dunlop Doriza Z3s. So far, I'm really liking the tires. I don't really have complaints other than I rub like a mofo. The reason why I rub is not because I'm too low, it's because of my suspension. So I ended up stiffening my suspension from, we started off at 15, went down to 10, nine, 10 in the front, nine in the rear from hard, then nine, eight. And then after throwing these wheels on, I had to go all the way down to two, which I actually like the ride. It's not bad at all, but I am rubbing still, even on two. My fender liner, definitely saved my fenders. When I met up with Nico, Daniel, Jeff, and them in LA, I drove back and I was jumping around, um, even on two clicks from hard. And uh, yeah, I mean, my fenders are okay, which I'm glad, but I actually have an appointment to get my fenders rolled. I kind of didn't want to go that route, but kind of have to with these meaty tires. 235 in the front, 255 in the rear. So gonna have to roll them. Um, have an appointment with a uh, guy in Brea. You guys might know him, so stay tuned. Also, another thing as well, is that I am now filming with my DSLR. I have a Canon Rebel SL1, and before for the videos, I was filming with my GoPro Hero 8 Black. So my last video, when I installed my TE, was the first time I started using the camera. Still adjusting, still getting used to it, so if you see a change in quality, it's probably because of the camera. It's not the best, but I wanted to start using the DSLR to uh, change up the lenses and uh, try something new. So. Hopefully you guys like it, and if not, just let me know in the comments below, and I possibly will switch back. I'm still kind of going back and forth, but yes, time to go to my appointment in Brea. Deuce. Alright, just got to Brea. It's currently 9.50, and my appointment's at 10 o'clock, so I want to pull up at 9.55 just to, you know, in respect for his time. So the guy that I'm visiting uh, for my fender roll is gonna be Mr. Sexy S2K. So you may or may not know him, but he has a really, really nice build. And if I'm not mistaken, it's Voltex, authentic Voltex all the way around. Yeah, I've been following this guy ever since I made a car Instagram. So about a year and a half to two years ago, and I've just followed him for his build, but he started posting a lot of uh, fender work, a lot of uh, uh, him rolling fenders um, and different cars, NSX, Porsches, etc. Yeah, I'm excited to uh, see his work firsthand. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna leave the camera in the car and hang out with him for a little bit, check out his build and yeah. All right, let's go. All right, so I just finished up with David, also known as uh, Mr. Sexy S2000 and the job he did is solid. And what he ended up doing was rolling my front fenders and then cutting the uh, the trim in the rear. 100% needed uh, because on the way back, I didn't rub at all, so I was super happy about that. But the con is that he ended up saying that these ICB spec TEs are really aggressive. So first off, I should have ran two 45s in the rear and it would have fit better um, with less rub on the tire. And he also suggested that I get ball joints in the front um, to get about 3.4 to 3.5 camber and then for the rears to do rear upper control arm so I can max out at a 3.5 as well 3.4 3.5 3.6 so I might do those adjustments I'm not too sure because how it sits right now is not bad I ended up changing all sides of suspension to full stiffening so it's zero <laughs> zero clicks from hard all the way around but the ride quality is not as bad as I expected it to be with the 14k spring rate in the front 12k spring rate in the rear. So on the little small bumps like this, I would actually rub in the rears and the fronts, but no rub at all. So definitely great work for sure. This bulge right here was actually from me just hitting my freaking tire on the freeway on the way back from LA. But he cleaned this up, cut it out, great fitment, relocated the back tab as well. For the front, he pulled it and also trimmed it, so it feels great in the back. Look at that no bulge as well. Same for this side too. Super aggressive TEs, dude. The poke is insane. But if you look, my tire was rubbing really bad. But that's pretty much gonna be it for today. I'm gonna head back and uh, actually stop in Anaheim to hang out with uh, Janelle and OJ, just so they can see the car. They haven't seen it yet. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to have a short one to uh, visit Mr. Sexy S2000 to get my my fenders rolled and trimmed so solid day so far might go home change my oil i'm not too sure but other than that that's pretty much it ladies and gentlemen until the next video deuces Type of
time when I'm focused. You cannot deny where I'm on. Westside nigga gon' go for y'all. I'm gon' treat it like I'm old to y'all. This ain't nothing new.